Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics, happy to see you here. Really interesting equation today, we have 5 to the power x equal to 5x, and we need to find our x in this equation. Okay, let's start to solve it. First of all, we need to know about logarithm, this is a classic moment right here, because if we, have, if we take logarithm from both of the sides, we will have this x jumps right here. So take a look closely, we have natural log of 5 to the power x equal to natural log of 5x. So we just write log on both sides. But on the left hand side this log is really good because our x jump right here in the beginning and we have x times natural log 5 equal to natural log 5x. Okay, I hope you understand this step. Okay, let's go, let's go next. What are we going to do next? First of all we need to multiply both sides by 5. Try to understand my step, I try to explain it. Okay, multiplying both sides by 5. If you multiply both sides by 5, we have that 5x times natural log 5 equal to 5 times natural log 5x. I try to go step by step to the Lambert W function, okay? Okay, what are we going to do next? Take a look closely. Let's divide both sides by 5 and by by 5x. So what we have as a result on the on the left hand side, we have that natural log 5 dividing by 5, we divide in both sides by 5, equal to natural log 5x right here, we have natural log 5x, and I want to write this element 5x as e to the power minus natural log 5x. So I hope you understand this step. I write this element 5x in this way and, ju and jump right here on the right hand side. Okay, what are we going to do next? Take a look closely what I'm going to do. We have this element with this minus sign. And we need to write this logarithm with this minus sign because we're going to apply Lambert W function. And let's multiply both sides by minus. If we multiply both sides by negative sign, we have this element with minus sign, so minus natural log 5x times this element e to the power minus natural log 5x equal to minus natural log 5 over over 5. So I hope you understand this step, we're just multiplying both sides by, by minus. But if you look closely to this, it is a really good moment to apply Lambert W function. What is Lambert W function? Take a look closely. If we have Lambert W function, for example, of element key to the power e to the power key. Okay, if you apply this, you will have only our key. Doesn't matter what is the value, this is a constant, this is x, this is a variable, we have only our key. And if you look closely to our expression on the left hand side, we have same elements, this one and this one are the same elements. And in our rule, key and key are the same. So if we apply Lambert W function from the left hand side, minus natural log 5x times e to the power minus natural log 5x, which is equal to Lambert W function of minus natural log 5 over 5, so we apply from both sides. We have as a result, we have only our this expression minus natural log 5x, so minus natural log 5x equal to Lambert W function of the minus natural log 5 over over 5. So this is maybe the main difficulties in this problem. So to apply correctly Lambert W function. Okay, what are we going to do next? I want to show you a really good moment right here because we have natural log 5x right here. I put right here with this natural log 5x, I put a triangle. Okay, we have right here a triangle. And if it goes right here, I put right here a triangle. But if you look closely, we have natural log 5x and natural log 5x. But in the same case, natural log 5x equal to x times natural log 5. So we can substitute this element by x times natural log 5 because this is completely the same. So we have minus, minus x times natural log 5 equal to, equal to Lambert W function in that point, in point minus natural log 5 over, over 5. Okay, I hope you understand this moment. And the last step right here, we have only our x, this is a constant, this is a constant, so we like complete our, our problem, we solved it by, we need to find our x. Okay, let's multiply both sides by minus, or let's divide by minus natural log 5. So what for final answer we will have? We will have that x equal to, 
we have right here in our nominator this element lambda w function in this point minus natural log 5 over 5 and we divide in by minus natural log 5 minus natural log natural log 5 and this will be our answer because this is a constant constant and this is a constant as well this is not like a this is not like a variable this is some number right here and of course if we write this expression in wolfram or like in any number w function values you will have our, your answer that x approximately equal to 0 0.353 and this is our answer but i want to mention one really interesting moment right here because it looks like we solve it with lambert w function we find our x but let's look closely to this 5 to the power x equal to 5x let's look closely to this it's not like a huge number it's not like a square cubes we have like two same numbers we have our x so it looks like 0 1 2 3 we need to check this these values and we need to find more roots right here if it's possible of course and let's try to to solve it in an easy way let's try to check 0 1 2 3 because we find our decimal answer but this not like a complicated equation so we if we plug in 0 we have not equal to we have not good equation because if 0 we have 1 equal to 0 which is not correct if we have 1 we have 5 equal to 5 and we we by inspection we find our second root we find that our x equal to 1 if x equal to 2 25 equal to 10 if x equal to 3 125 equal to 15 so as you can see this goes right here this goes right here so there's no will be roots in in further further values so our answer will be our answer will be x first i write it in in order x first equal to one with an integer and x second equal to approximately equal or i write it as equal 0 0.353 so this is my approach to this to this problem what do you think about it what do you think about this route how can we find it write your question in comment write your suggestion in comment it will be very, very inter interesting to read it and of course thank you so much for watching thank you for supporting my channel i really appreciate it it helps me a lot to make new content and of course if you enjoy it it's not hard to you but it's really kind from you to to put your thumbs up to write any comment it helps me a lot and it improves my videos i try to make content every day so it really inspires me a lot what do you think about this solution write your question in comment write your suggestion in comment what do you think about this approach maybe you have another approach to this problem it will be really to read it as well so thank you so much for watching have a great day take care of yourselves and see you in the next videos